Hello, Oceanographers, and welcome back to another San Andreas' Finest. We are on duty here. We're going to be EMS tonight, along with uh, Bailey. We're partnering up her, with her today on Medic 1. And that's a good thing, because if you guys watched the last episode, uh, Glennon was subpoenaed to court as a witness for the case against uh, San Andreas versus Maria Sanchez. Um, this is a great opportunity for him, because he feels like he'll be able to maybe get her out of prison and into a mental health facility where she belongs but we'll see how that goes uh we're gonna have to talk to bailey because bailey was also involved and she may have been subpoenaed as well we don't know yet so we're gonna talk to her tonight and find out um maria has a parole hearing on friday yes and i um i pushed for that i talked to the justice mostly through the mayor's office i was able to get an audience with them which was great and i kind of just slipped it in there when i was making a bunch of other changes with the city um and uh they said sure so to my knowledge it's the three judges are gonna decide the final outcome like they're gonna vote because it's just very hard you know as in san andreas to get you know 12 unbiased jury members in the yeah um but um I don't know. I talked with Maria. She's hired a lawyer. I'm meeting with her and the lawyer on Monday. Or t yeah. To discuss, like, the case. But right now, we're currently trying to get access to her file. Because she herself has never seen her file, which is kind of a violation of her rights. But we won't get into that. Yeah. Um, we can use that. The case, she was charged against torture for Campbell. Like, she wasn't charged for anything against me or you, right? I don't think so. I, I know we... I like to not to press charges, and I could have swore Campbell didn't press charges either. She didn't, but they the cops overrid that and then sentenced her to life. And so we're trying to fight that, that she served long enough in jail and she's been rehabilitated and everything. Does your gaming community need a custom website and forums? Look no further than Sonoran CMS's fully integrated management software. Learn more at sonorancms.com slash ocean. Okay. I'm glad. I'm glad you're going to be there. I, I'm, ex I'm excited. It's finally getting its day. It was, should have been long ago, but... Yeah, I, I'm I'm happy for this, too. This is this is our chance to get her out of prison and either into a facility that can help her or get her back out, you know, in the world again. Yeah, exactly. I mean, she's been seeing a therapist for months, and she's I've seen her a few times. Like, she's gotten better. I just... I don't... I don't... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hopefully this will work. Yeah, like I said, we'll do, we'll discuss it more, but oh, that's so interesting. I also um, I also got a message from the prosecutors and was like, "Are you um for or against the defendant?" And I was like, uh, "I'm not supporting you." Like I didn't give them much detail, but I was just like, "Yeah, really." Like, <laughs> like go find your own witnesses. Like I was the one who suggested you and Campbell and myself on her side. So I'm like, I don't. Yeah, no, I'm uh, I'm definitely going to be a witness for her on her side, for sure. Thank you. Thank you for that. I, I mean, I know she's hurt you, and that's a weird thing to ask, but it it means so much to me, boss, and I do. Yeah, I mean, you, kn you know where I stand with her, you know, the, the last time, you know, she was out, you know, in that warehouse, you know, you, you know what I said to her and to the, to the cops, so that's, I still, I still stand my ground on that. Talking yeah. about that foosball. It's not even football. Uh, I'm gonna no. I'm gonna walk away before I have an aneurysm. I mean, the real football gives you a better thing where you can hold up. Now you look in here, Bobby Boucher. All right, we ain't playing no foosball. He's talking about throwing that around that pigskin. You hear? Turn around. <laughs>
Yeah, I think I got it. Thank you. It's been a while since I did that. <laughs> Touching Sundress Hobbs with 3036 for a female with unknown injuries. That's special 3036 for, unknown, for a female with unknown injuries. Be advised, we'll try to get more information as soon as we can. Medic one. Five for a second. Huh. It's all good. Show sure, medic one responding. I'm gonna pull up the notes. See if there's any additional. Yeah. Oh, one that's female. Very that vague. is all it says. Okay. We have a female patient. Hey. You all right? Medic one to station don't six. Worry. Need He's medic right. five down here He's to uh, right. nine one three seven. Bike right. versus vehicle. No, yeah, he right. fell. He fell, oh, he fell off his. He fell off his oh, bike and died. Yeah, all right, man. We got a medic coming. You've got medic. Okay, you don't need to worry. No, we do need to worry. Um, let's stay here until medic five. Medic five, step it up so we can get the R call. Medic one to fire radio. Uh, we're gonna need PD out here too to 9137. It's a bit of an altercation between Don't move people. Him. What are you doing? Hey, knock that Don't off! Push him. Stop it! We got a fight in progress, 9137. Engine 5, get these guys off this guy. We gotta continue our, our call. God damn. Um, they can handle that. Yeah. Let's go find our girl. Medic 2, my partner is not around, it seems. Get someone off from Toa. Great, that last year. Fire radio, powerful. Good call. Do you find space with him? So we've got a vehicle leaving the scene from 9-1, so I'll check it out now. Damn, I should've gotten a vehicle description on that thing. It's like a black um, low rider. Already have two. And then two men in black suits and hats. Measure yeah. internal, brick measure eight to any available unit eight, nine, one, three, seven. Okay. Thanks, Andy. Oh, yeah, that was very close. That scared the hell out of me. <laughs> Show medic one in the area attempting to locate. Maybe in the... Hi. Alright, my bad. Just real quick, uh, we cancelled medical. We just had the, the channel held uh, for our, our situation. Uh, but there is, uh, they're probably going to need you guys shortly. Uh, whenever the, they secure the scene on the other thing. Uh, oh, like what shots happened fired to the girl? Did she not need medical? She, didn't, she, didn't, she did not. We had nothing to hold her on and she says she does not want medical. So I had to let her go. Bar ready in channel. Sounds good, okay. thank what's you. Okay, uh, what's the other thing? Sorry about that. Um... Sounds like there was shots fired. I, there might be someone down. Uh, I'll probably call you guys out soon. All right, cool. Uh, Do you know the post a little? Yeah. Uh, it sounds like one. But uh, just I say standby for a dispatcher. Okay. To uh, get more information. Oh, no, sorry, the postal, not the. <laughs> oh, my bad. Yeah, I don't. I don't have that area right now. Okay, Negative. no worries. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Medic one, fire radio. Medic one. As per uh, sheriff's office, we are uh, no longer needed. Uh, patient is uh, no longer on the scene. Uh, we're going to be code four ten eight up here in Sandy. However, we do have a uh, 
possible call pending according to them for shots fired in the area. If um be possible Alright, now we wait. Yeah. Okay. There it is. Oh. <laughs> wow, look at that timing. I didn't even get a chance to wait. Attention center is far up here in route to south of mile marker Ida for a vehicle on fire. That is Oh, just kidding. Oh well that's different. <laughs> mile marker Ida for a vehicle on fire. Carpool, you'll have tower five and rescue five on route at this time. Do you we have any UHC assets available? Medic 1 to command and direct. We're code 4. We can head that way. I'll take 40 from if you could. I found the down guy. Oh yeah, is that it? Yeah, I don't know if it's clear, but there's a guy laying on the ground and they're doing like some kind of medical on him. Oh god damn it. Let's go look at it. Copper engine 5 is going to be on route as well. Copy. New dispatch. Panorama Drive. Yep, never mind. Hey, go help them. I'm gonna go, uh... Okay, cool. I'll let them know. So, if I'm responding... to command? Go Uh, we're gonna have to cancel our response to Mile Marker Ida. Uh, the Sheriff's Office has a person down at 3008. Not called out yet, but we just rolled into it. Call 40 from keeping me updated on that call, please. Engine 5 and... Tower and rescue. Once you get on the scene, you're gonna to have to stand by for a medic. I've got no one available for you. Fire ready. Two units responded to South Mile Mark Ida. Pier 5 County is advising the vehicle has exposed at this time. Fire ready, mm -hmm. action. Hey boss, uh, so this wasn't the guy who got shot, uh, they just found him here in the road. Uh, he was throwing up. I'm kind of tilted him on this side and I'm looking for external injuries right now. Uh, okay. He said it's close to 65, so he's stable in that. I'm not sure what his blood pressure are. are. Yeah, let me get the, uh, we can flip him over. So I want to get the leads PM. on. Yeah. Yeah, thank you guys. Appreciate you. Flashlight his eyes here. They look pretty red. I see some swelling too in his throat. Sir, are you cocked? Sir, can you hear me? Hey, check his airway. Alright, pulse is 59, 113 over 76. That's Troy's 4. He's got obstructed airway, He's I bet. Breathing. Yeah, airway's a little All bit. Right. Let's, let's get the suction unit and get this vomit out. Yep. You got it. Yeah. Advise him before the tunnel. Okay, I got it. Okay. Receive before the tunnel. Advise him before the tunnel on. Yeah, let's start manual, uh, manual respirations. Yep. Respiration, sorry. Medic one to command. Uh, we have one airway uh, tapped at our location. Three zero one zero. Ten four. Stand by. I'll get you some more medical assets. Alright, we're at an 8. That's a slight improvement. Okay, nice. I'm just gonna look and just see if I can find a name, make sure he's not allergic to anything, or... Yeah. Yeah. I can't tell if this is an re allergic Very reaction or not. Yeah, that's what I was wondering. And be my mocker either. Rescue 5 gonna be on scene. It's gonna be after the tunnel. Nothing at all comes up under that name. Okay. Yeah, honestly, we're next to Sandy, so... Southbound lane. Shut down at this yeah, time. let's get a C collar on. Just um, I want to monitor his. I want to monitor his um airway. Just make sure it doesn't hurt at all. Looks like it's going up though, which is a good sign. It's up to 12 now, and okay. BP is down, so that's a good thing. Okay, good. I think the suction's working. So. Yeah, you mind getting the striker out of the medic, and then we'll uh, I'll, I'll take over manual. Yeah, hey, uh, deputy, do you mind uh, giving us a hand getting him on the striker? Yeah. Um, is this guy just having like a medical episode or is this like actually like... It looks like a reaction to something is my guess. His throat is pretty swelled up and his eyes are red. Um, not sure what it is. Uh, actually, oh, it's probably too cold for bees so I can't yeah, imagine that. Any, like external injuries or anything which is interesting besides like... 
No medical history yeah, pulls like up. There's like 50 things going on in one spot here, so I'm just trying to figure right. out if this guy is uh, involved with something. Or... Lift him up on the count of three. Uh, we can check with the doctors, get you a more detailed report if it was like an attack or something. Yeah. Um, if you could have them send me his like name if they can get it. Sure. I wasn't able to pull it. One, two, three, lift. Yep. Up. Oh. And on the striker. There we go. There we go. And then, um. Yep, that works. All right, let's get him over. Thank you, deputy. Right. Yeah, it's, oh, what was that sound? Uh, I'm gonna sit in the I'm gonna sit in the back and keep an eye on that. Yep, and look. <laughs> I heard yeah. something drop. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There's a there's a gun there. I must have missed it when I was looking for his wallet. Um, oh, yeah. Um. Yeah. Hey, deputies. Just yeah. you know, double check. No, you know. If you want, yeah, you can put them. At the hospital on hold or whatever. Yeah. We'll have local guards. That's your choice. I don't know. I just want to get him there. Take it. You're just transport one now, yeah? Yeah, yeah Sandy. Yeah. Okay, wonderful. Carpool, give me the location of that dark bike call. I'll be on there. Okay. Um, your patient's name now is uh, Charles Bradford. So. Yes. Yeah. If yeah, you guys yeah. just put him in the in the hold, we'll try to figure out what happened here. All right. We'll let him know. Thank you. Thank you. I'll let, uh, let them know we're transporting, please. Medic 176, finish your medical 147. Copy that. I have no idea what's going on with this guy. Like, he has no gunshot injuries or, like, physical injury. I don't, okay. Yeah, and I don't want to push any medication just because we're getting we're so close, so. Exactly, yeah, it's like, I don't, we'll just get him. The doctors will take care of him. Uh, is this ours? Yeah, this is our location. Yeah, yeah. God damn, this thing barely fits under here. Medic, we're on arrival to Hospital. Get our striker back. Alright, nurse, we got uh, one patient uh, had respiratory issues and uh, clogged airway when we had him. Uh, he was intubated on scene. No medications were pushed. Uh, name's gonna be a... Radford, first name, Charles. Yeah. Um, swollen neck, uh, red eyes, uh, not responsive. Uh, eyes were responsive. Yeah, uh, pupils rather, and I cannot talk tonight. So, all yours. I hope you feel better soon, sir. Um, there'll be a local guard outside your door. Just talk to him or PD and then from there. Oh, yeah, also nurses, he's on a hold as per uh, BCSO. Thank you. Alrighty then. Okay. I was expecting a gunshot victim when we pulled up there. I was too. 2047. I don't know what the call is, uh, but we're going there. Okay, <laughs> I'll, yeah, I'll yeah. let him know. Show medic one in route to postal 2047. Copy that, better one. Actually, avoid that previous scene we were at. Good, good plan, good plan. Go for medic one. Go for medic one. Just for reference to your patient, you've got one male conscious on the layout. He's talking to he's just got lacerations, it's possible head injury, I'm testing that. Uh, again, you can then be priority to. Medic one copy. I've seen here too, what? Yeah. Busy and Sandy tonight. We do about the crime level here, uh, Miss Mayor, huh? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> just kidding. No, no, that's a fair question. And our, our wonderful deputies can take care of it. I'm trusting them. Oh, this is the fire vehicle. Yeah. It's in the charger there. Wait, cool, thank you. Scene? I thought we were going somewhere else. I, th I think this is Unlikely, it. Unlikely, not going to need transport. He's got lacerations. He's got. His pupils are a wee bit slow to react. I'm thinking of head injury. I'll let you determine. Just okay. Go. He was in an accident, was it? Yeah, she fell off his bike. I'm not sure if he crashed or if he just lost control. 
Okay, yeah. cool. I'm a fair walk on that. Did you put a vest on, sir? Do you feel that unsafe? Look, a lot of stuff's in going on in Sandy Blaine right County now. Sandy Shores. Listen, it's great. Hi, sir. You conscious? What up? Mind if we get he's you on this the car other here? Side. Oh, I think he's on this side. He's on the other side. You yeah. sure? Can we get him out then, ma'am, if you don't mind? Yeah, I can get him out. No, nope, I'm actually on this side. Oh, oh my gosh. I don't even remember what side I put him on. I mean, he probably slid over. <laughs> we can't believe you don't. You All really right. Know. Watch your head. Don't do anything. Me? Really? Yeah. No, you've been shot yeah. yourself, Adam. So. Not in my That's Blaine County. Blaine County. Hey, sir, we're uh, with the paramedics with That's the cool. uh, Sandra's Fire Rescue. Okay. Uh, I'm just going to look you over here real quick. You want to tell my uh, friend here uh, what happened today? I was I'm stupid. I uh, 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 I'll be away. sufficient just as it's dark enough I can see hotspots. Okay, what's your name? Kevin Jenkins. What was that? Kevin. Yeah, nice to meet you. I'm Bailey. This is my partner, uh. Evelyn. I, uh, I yeah. Think she struggles to know your name by the sound of it. I know, yeah. I did. It's I, a real I problem. I was gonna go with, like, Chief Glenn, and then I just stopped and didn't say anything. It's you okay. So, you haven't got a head injury. Maybe. When's your birthday, sir? I really can't remember. Hey, so, Karen, how fast were you going when you had that injury? I managed to break to 25 to 30, but I don't crash anyone. Alright. Uh, just go ahead and lean on that vehicle there, because it looks like you're... How's your kneecap feeling there? At the minute, I can't feel it. It was very dumb. Okay. You able, you able to put weight on it, or no? I did that, and I fell over nearly. Oh, jeez. Right. Let me look here. All right, how, uh, how's that feel? Also, uh, sir, while he looks over your knee there, I'm just going to take off your hat and check out your head here. Hmm, okay. Go for medic tube. All right, just uh, help him uh, stand there for a minute. I'm just going to get the back. Yes, or, uh, you can just lean around. against me, sir. So you don't put any pressure on it while we get that splinted. We'll get you on this. Hey, All right, so put this here. All right, sir, if you just want to do a 180 here and just uh, sit down on the stretcher and then try to pull, it, pull up your one leg, we'll help you get the other leg up. There you go. Perfect. That was helping with that. Sir. Perfect. All right. I'm going to uh, splint your leg here. That way it kind of immobilizes it. That way we don't have it move around too much. All right. Yep. No, we are going to want to get you the hospital for that knee, though, sir. Which one? Sandy? Or. I mean, do you have a preference? Sandy. Okay, yeah. yeah, we can do that. All right. We got that there. And uh, did we get his name in medical history? Copy. He did, uh, yes, sir. Okay. With, uh, and now, how's your pain level there, sir, Kieran? Seven and a half to eight. Ooh, okay. Wow, you're a real trooper for <laughs> talking as level as you are, considering that number. All right. Um, this is not the first time I've done something stupid. I gotcha. All right, well, here, here's the thing. Um, we can elect to not give you any pain medications right now because we are very close to Sandy, so they can, you know, handle it there if you're okay with just waiting a couple more minutes. Uh, truthfully, I was fine with cocaine on me, so I don't have any case just in case it reacts. Ah, that would explain Did why you you're take not. Any of that cocaine today? Medic two. That's a small bit. Oh, okay. Medic well, two that would be under list of, I guess, not technically medication. That's my bad. I should have asked for drugs, sir. Be advised, my partner okay. ended up having head How much did you take? Return. <laughs> uh, two lines. About okay. an hour and a half ago. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Which is why I said I don't have medication in case they react and they cause more issues and it's just that whole issue. You're actually extremely smart, sir. I appreciate that. Thank you. I have moments in life where I have that moment of relapse and concentration. I could be smart, I could be stupid, and it's sometimes both. Okay, uh, just tell them. Yeah, Guys, is he, uh, is he murdered? 
Alright. Alright, so pretty much what happened is he pepper sprayed a female, a female shot him. Uh, that's what ended up happening with that shooting down there. Medical one forty seven. Hey, Mr. Kieran. So, yep, you took some coke today, and then you were just riding that motorcycle and you crashed it. Someone drove into me nearly, so I chased Someone them. Someone drove into you. Oh, okay. Yeah. And then so they I just drove off. That was rude of them. No, they were getting gas. So I went to talk to them, and then they got a bit hostile, so I sprayed them with pepper spray. And then he shot at me, but no one hit me. Okay, but he, yeah, he didn't hit you. So they were talking about you. So, okay. I was gonna say it's real. Uh, <laughs> real rap sheet. If that was you. Huh. I don't know if they were a firefighter though. That's the issue. So they looked like they had a uh, firefighter T-shirt on, but I couldn't really see That's very well. That's the pepper spray guy. That makes more sense now. Wait, was it wasn't a female, right? It was a gentleman that you that shot at you. Hey, I don't know. You know, that's the thing. The officer back there was mentioning a female, one said a male. So I'm kind of confused which one it was. Have the cops put this together? Like, I feel like we just did the detective work with our two patients. I think I well, no, I think they were. I think I heard uh, the under sheriff uh, mention. I think they. I think they're. They've got it. Aware okay, of it. cool. I was like, it's not my job, but I'm glad y'all are both alive and safe, is what I care about. I guess they think I'm a female, but I'd be worried if I was. Medic one arrival, Sandy Shores Hospital. So, in conclusion, the call was the shots fired. He had pepper spray, which I guess he's allergic to, which caused him to swell up, and then. I mean, no, if he got like a if he got like a major dose of pepper spray, like your throat could close up. Because you to throw up and then the throat gets stuck in your throat. No, that makes sense. I'm we yeah. mystery solved. Yeah. Yes. Yep, somewhere. Okay, medic one, come on now. AM74 car command, can we get uh, what this call is? I need to pull it up a bit. Advise person down of unknown causes. Yeah, of maybe. Yeah, okay, I got it. I'll use this one. Fire, you said there was a fire, yeah? Report of an active fire, 3 Jesus Christ! Fire, fire down. Hey, M74, did she say active fire or did she say shot fired? Active fire. Chief is currently down, he's got burns on him. I'm gonna drag you. Yeah, get a fire here. Yeah, I got him. I got him. Let's go. Go, go, get the beat. Let's go. Not going to car. Medic one to medic two. We're gonna have the chief behind the police car so you can come help provide medical. You gonna make it up? Can you hear me? Yes. Call for the line one two. Make two copies. Make two is about three mics out. Boss, can you hear me? And if I advise, do we still have active fire? You are this man. Panorama Drive, 3037. 
Hey, I'm sorry, for you, Marcus, in the area, 807. Come on, Chief, I'm gonna check his vital. I'm building something for you to stay all the mouse and switch off the golden case. You have scissors, can you cut that vest off? Rescue 574. Yeah. Oh shit, the f this frickin' happened. Um, I'm seeing some burns across his face. Hey, come on, breathe for me, boss. Panic unit 142 5027 Great Ocean Highway slash Barbara. Okay, I'm gonna put some gauze here, get his face cooled down. Um, his air is clear. Um, I do have a pulse, thank you. Oh my gosh, chief. Hey, just charge light. Medic 2, what's your status? Meg 2, I'm just now entering Sandy near, uh, near, uh, 3032. One mic out. Hey, I'm to give you an update. I do have a light pulse, thankfully. Uh, I've got burns across his face as well as, uh, external injury. Is it, he's bleeding from back to the head. Yeah, no, that's a lot. Can you have pressure there? Yeah, I got it. I'm gonna start an IV. Just had a trooper I really, really appreciate it. I got you. God damn! Out of nowhere, <laughs> this happened. Your sleeve off. Holy shit! Why didn't that vest protect you from the fire? Out of twelve, what's your status? Can't alert an engine five of pump operator. Go. Run foam to discharge two, and we got uh, gas here. Running foam to discharge two. I'll step by. 7621A <laughs> break 76 men. Yes. Simon. Stumpy, somebody is going to go car one down. Bailey, can you report your location, please? Hey, from where to be directly behind Medic 2. Alright, where are we going? Alright, so uh, Chief here, he was pulling gas, the gas station exploded, uh, he got burns on him as well, he hit against the medic, he's got an injury there. His airway's clear, pulse is low, burns across his face, bleeding from the back of his head. I started an IV, and uh, the officer there held pressure on the bleeding on his head. I need a pump right, I'll get the this uh, wound wrap right, and then we're gonna load and go and get him to a burn unit. Puppy, uh, could you recheck his vitals again, sir, or whoever's the firefighters just pulled up? Because I haven't checked him in a minute. That'd be McCullough. McCullough? No, I thought. Never mind. Uh, you, you lead. Um, okay. Come on. I'll get some people to help with treatment if he needs. I'll check the vitals real quick, and then I'll get that. I'm gonna make sure this bleeding stops here. Fire, Still not conscious. Jeez. Vitals are elevated. Vitals, wake up! Come on, Chief, you've been through work. God damn, I cannot believe this happened. <laughs> that scared the hell out of me, guys. Watching this. Oh my god. Call for a top team. Can I confirm all fires extinguished? Has the ceasefire been assessed yet? Uh, negative on that. Angel be advised, fire, uh, fire is extinguished. Fuel supply is shut off. There is only some, uh. There's only some hot spots left. His clothes are off now. I'm just gonna check, make sure the burns were just on his face. Gauze behind his head. Okay, he Alright, I'm just gonna secure it here. Perfect, just in case, might as well. And I'm checking the C spine now. Do you not have a partner? No, uh, they had head issues. Gotcha, okay, no worries. We've got a medic and two medics. We got this. <laughs> Is Sandy equipped for this kind of burns? Or do we need to they go are to... not. We need okay, to get yeah, we gotta get into to... Great Ocean or Pillbot. 
Hey, I know this is probably a lot to ask officers, but is there any way you can help escort and just lock the road a bit so we can get him a fast transport down? We can try. We just had a trooper kidnap, so I can't promise for Oh, jeez. Okay, no worries. All right, we'll get him there. spine looks fine, but muscles around neck are look like they may have been pulled. I'm going to um, get a seat collar on just to be sure. Yeah, got the trooper. No worries. We'll take care of our chief. 76. Man, you want me to start to the hospital? Prep, prep, prep. You guys want anything for me? Mm, uh, grab the stretcher, actually, from the back of the medic. Would be great. Uh, we'll pull it over here. Be advised. I don't think we'll need an air med. We'll, uh, we're about to be transported Yeah, now. we're just loading go. Awesome. Can I help you? Interior, command. Cool. Right, let's... Primary. I think we'll pretty much just help us load him up here in a second. Please. I'll have you one guy, at least one for the escort. Thank you so Thank much, you. Sir. We're gonna load out here in like about two minutes. Help out yeah, if you don't mind. I'm trying to keep tabs on the situation with state. Alright. Stretch is there. Let's go ahead and get him loaded. Let's go. We'll lift on three. You count? One, two, and three. And given us, given that medic, uh, he's already got it. He's already got it set up. Let's get him back. Thank you. All right, you you want to be in back with him? Yeah, yeah, I'll take him back with him. So we're getting an escort now. Hey, he's stable back here. How far out are we from Pillbox? Uh, I believe about two mics. Okay, copy the hat. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so unexpected. Hey, we pulled ahead, right? The trauma center knows we're there? Yeah, they did. Okay. Hey, we got the best people in the city that are going to be there, okay? As soon as we get there, we're going to treat you. Just. Uh, so I'm role playing out that the chief hit when the explosion happened. He hit the side of the medic so hard it knocked him out. I guess the vest saved him though. I was not expecting. Oh my! I, I saved him from any uh, uh, any further injury. So. Lucky him.
put on fire. He uh, hit his head against Medic, it's bleeding pretty rapidly on the back as well as burns across his face. He's been unconscious the entire time. We do have rapid vitals and a low pulse though, please. Take good care of him. Bailey, let, let's get yeah. you checked over too. You yeah, were you yeah, were I'll there. Look. Chief Togana was admitted to Pillbox Hill Hospital after an explosion in Sandy. <clears throat> he had minor burns, a concussion, head injury, and a uh, sprained neck and right arm. He was brought into surgery. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Um, also, uh, doctors report that the plate vest saved his chest from being crushed uh, as a result of being thrown against the ambulance. So, my goodness. Car floor organ, so just had a call from Pillbox. Be advised, the Chief is currently stable. He's not currently available for visitation. All units can just report to Station 6, please. 